Welcome back. Today we're diving into the beast that is the 2025 Caterpillar D13, covering its exterior design, interior features, performance stats, and of course, how much it'll cost you. Let's roll. Let's start with the exterior. The D13's design is bold and imposing, built for work sites where form follows function. Its large, heavy-duty tracks dominate the lower half, giving it serious ground contact and traction. The chassis is robust, with reinforced panels and protective guards over hydraulic lines and vulnerable components. Up front, there's a massive blade assembly, engineered for tough push and dig tasks, with strong linkages and cylinders clearly visible. The bulldozer's body is angular, with sharp edges but also smooth transitions where needed to deflect debris. The exhaust stacks rise boldly from the engine bay, and ventilation grills flank the sides to channel airflow and cooling. Every surface looks engineered to stand up to abuse, stone, dust, mud, you name it. The paint is a signature caterpillar yellow, finished in a durable matte to resist chips and scratches. Branding is prominent. Cat logos on the front, sides of the cab, and rear panels, giving it a strong identity on the job site. Moving inside to the interior. Stepping into the D13's cab feels more like entering a high-end control center than a construction machine. The operator's seat is wide, heavily cushioned, and adjustable, with multiple axes of movement. Surrounding you are ergonomically placed controls, joysticks, levers, touchscreen displays, and physical switches all within easy reach. The dash layout is intuitive. The main central display shows engine data, fuel levels, system diagnostics, and real-time performance metrics. Secondary gauges flank that for auxiliary systems like hydraulics, oil pressure, and temperatures. Visibility is excellent, thanks to large wraparound windows and narrow pillars, with protective mesh or steel screens in places to guard against flying debris. Climate control is robust, with heating, ventilation, and AC built to handle dusty environments. The cab is well sealed to minimize dust and noise, and there's sound insulation to keep engine roar and vibration in check. Storage compartments, cup holders, and tool trays are integrated into the cabin, and you'll even find modern touches like USB ports and perhaps a small infotainment or connectivity module for monitoring or remote diagnostics. Safety features include rollover protection, emergency exits, and efficient access steps and handrails to enter and exit. Now on to performance. Under the hood or within the body, the D13 is powered by a next-generation diesel engine, let's call it the CAT-C32 or its successor, producing an immense horsepower figure, reputed in some sources to be around 860 horsepower. This gives the D13 serious pushing, ripping, and grading capability. It delivers massive torque at low RPMs, ideal for heavy earth moving, rock work, or large-scale site preparation. The transmission is heavy-duty and likely automatic or semi-automatic, optimized to shift under load with minimal power loss. The hydraulic system is high capacity, ensuring responsive control of blade, ripper if fitted tilt, raise lower, and side shift operations. Fuel efficiency is improved over older models thanks to modern engine management, electronic control systems, and optimized fluid dynamics. The cooling system is oversized to handle extreme environments, so operating temperatures remain stable under heavy load. On slopes or uneven ground, traction control, differential locks, and stability dampeners keep it planted. The D13 is built for long shifts, continuous high performance, minimal downtime, and consistent output. Let's talk numbers. In tests or field conditions, you might see blade forces in the multi-hundreds of thousands of pounds, travel speeds in operating mode perhaps up to 10 to 12 km per hour depending on gear and sight conditions, and lifting tilting speeds designed to balance force with smoothness. Efficiency is improved by onboard monitoring and predictive maintenance systems which alert the operator to needed service, filter changes, or potential wear before failure. Durability is key. Everything from heavy pins to structural welds is overbuilt. With proper maintenance, the machine is projected to run thousands of hours reliably. Finally, the price. The D13 is a premium, large-scale piece of machinery, not meant for generalized use. In 2025, its price is expected to match its capabilities. Depending on region, configuration, attachments, and dealer markups, estimates place it well into the high hundreds of thousands or even low millions in US dollars. Some sources suggest a shocking tag of around $700,000 for a fully equipped version. 
Others hint at even higher figures if additional options, advanced control packages, or heavy-duty attachments are included. That base figure, however, likely excludes shipping, taxes, dealer installation, optional attachments, and site prep. In markets with import duties, the final cost can easily climb further. It's not uncommon in heavy machinery for the true delivered cost to exceed list pricing by 10-20%. For a machine this size, every customization, from deluxe cab upgrades to premium attachments, can add tens of thousands more. When you include warranty packages, training, fuel, maintenance tooling, and logistical costs, the total investment can stretch upward significantly. In summary, the 2025 Caterpillar D13 is a showcase of what modern heavy equipment can be. Exterior toughness, interior comfort and control, high performance under extreme loads, and a price tag that reflects its elite capabilities. If your work demands maximum output, minimal downtime, and uncompromising durability, the D13 might be the machine you want. Let me know if you want a follow-up script focused just on operation demos or comparisons with rivals.